hardships and uh, just life here in Africa um, for the poor people. Um, it's really, it's really like you only get one chance at some things, to, and if you screw that up, you really might never see that chance again. In the states, a lot of times, like if you screw up once, there's always some kind of net. There's always another opportunity that could be close by your fingers to find. Um, just going to a counseling center or a local community center. In Kailicha, there's really no center like that to direct people where to go or how to find a career or how to find a job. Oftentimes you'll see people in town standing on corners just waiting for a contractor to come by and perhaps pick them up that day, maybe just saying he needs four workers and they pile into his car and they go to a site and just work for one day. So what we've been doing for uh, the past two months, three months since the field has been built, uh, has been working at the field to uh, find a way of making it self-sustainable. One of the ways we've been doing that is we've found a, a group of uh, 18 to 28 year old males, about 12 of them, who we've been working with. Um, the group calls themselves the Ambitious Youth of Kailicha. We met the Ambitious Youth through uh, a contact that Leo had at Bapamlele Orphanage in Kailicha. Um, it's right down the street from our field. Um, Papa Malele uh, saw that there's a number of kids, uh, not kids, but 18 to 20 year old guys um, that just sit around on the corner um, by, by the orphanage and just really don't have, are unemployed and don't have much to do all day. This is where the idea of Ambitious Suit of Kailicha started. Side B, Kailicha. And this is where we spend our time with the boys. We sit here, talk about a lot of things. It's a shake, but you can see, we're trying. This is the sea. Search. Ulali. Mabala, Maputi, Sean, Unux. This is where the idea started. This is Andile's place, but Andile for today is gone. He went to church. He didn't even take off his water. He was taking a bath. There's the term. I think Seth is going to be one of the guys who will be taking us for the walk today. We're gonna start by going out of here and trying to show you some of the places around and then we'll try to get as much as we can on the township side. Especially the boys, the corners, the fields. Anything that we can we can show you about where we stay, where we spend our daily life. Welcome to Kylie Chatuts. These are my friends, Mbangs with the blue t-shirt, Andile with the red one, Sakele with the FMW 29 t-shirt, the white one. Yep. This is South Africa. And, uh, South Africa! We hope that you guys are going to enjoy the video because this is a little we can do about how we live and, and all that stuff. Now we are going to take you to a, to a five-a-side tournament. It's a street game, but you're going to see the guys are enjoying it. We've got no facilities, so you will understand once you see what's happening. These are the public toilets that the people who are staying in this area are using. This is another place that sells Mukumboti.
Philippines. This is where we and um, these are kids playing. This is the place called what's the name of the place to play? Donkey Square Stadium. Hey, that's where we are. We have some refreshments. This is one of the stadium movies. As you can see, there's a lot of you <laughs> This is how we spend our Sundays in Kailicha. We watch young boys playing in the dead field. But they are enjoying it, but there's nothing they can do. Playing in the stadium takes some time. They have to be ready to start and all that. But not everyone has time for them because each and every person around is trying to get food for himself. So that's why there's, no, there's not enough people to try and be with kids. If they can be fans or something, then I think people will start to be interested in doing things like Leonora and Ryan have done for us. They are changing a bit of our daily lives step by step, but we'll see where it heads. But we still need more funds to try and be what we want to be. Slowly but surely, but we are getting there. We are trying our best every day. We are busy with football, watching kids, playing at least five. Time. 